Hey guys, Al here. I um, get started on some body work. I got the boxing primer now. Um, it's only first primer. There's still a little few spots like on the corner here. There's a little spot that needs to be touched up. It's uh, been blocked out once and now it's in its first primer. So I'll have to uh, touch up a few little spots on it, re-block it, reprime it. I started on the back fenders, um, very little body fill to get it, uh, still got a few little spots, little spot right there, one right here. Gotta get a little more shape in here. But uh, I'm getting started on it anyhow, on the bodywork. So yeah, all uh, all the fenders are in uh, pore 15. Um, still haven't figured out what I'm going to do with the shocks yet. I'd like to use those ones because the new style shocks just don't look right. I'm probably going to have to heat these up and bend them and turn them a different way so that they, uh, the way they are right now, they're going to bind when the wheel travels or when the springs travel. So if I turn it the other way, it won't bind. So. I'm going to try it. If I don't like it, I'll build a set of shock mounts, uh, shock towers. On the inside, try and hide it with the motor. But I'm hoping not to do that. So for the, the rest of the Easter weekend, I'm going to work on getting all the fenders done um, and in primer. We got all this stuff in primer already. And then uh, after I get uh, the fenders done, I'm going to start on the framework for the running boards and the splash aprons along the side there next. And then I'll uh, I'll get on to the cab. Okay, so I've got two of the fenders in uh, the bodywork, the first round of bodywork done on them. They're ready for the high build primer. I have the third, one of the front ones, just about ready. And one more over there to go. I'm hoping to get that done this weekend. Get them all in primer. And then I'm going to piece the box back together. And uh, pull the running boards and uh, the splash aprons. And get those ready to go. I finally figured out the shocks. <clears throat> so I can use these ones. But I have to wait until next week to fill my uh, gas bottle before I can finish them off. Body fill is not my favorite thing to do. but it's all part of the hot rod thing, right? Okay. So I, I found a few channels that I've been watching that are really good in case you want to watch 
more hot rod stuff while you're locked up in the house. And that's um, Half Ass Customs, Danny at DD Speed Shop, and Jeff and Dave at Sobering Restorations. Three good Canadian channels. All funny guys, they're fun to watch. And you'll learn stuff and not even know it. So check them guys out. Okay, thanks for watching. Uh, please subscribe. Comment. Hit the like button. Ring the bell. And uh, share on Facebook, Instagram, whatever you're hooked up on. Okay, thanks for watching.